Hey, what's up, people? Dennis Hample here, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how I sent over 100,000 DMs per client on uh, completely autopilot. I use AI replies and I use VAs to manage my campaign, so it's completely hands off. I'm gonna give you this entire system that's worth thousands and thousands of dollars to me that I sell as a service to you for free today. The only thing I ask from you is to give me a like if you think this video is valuable, okay? So without any further ado, let's jump straight into it, okay? So how to send 100,000 Instagram DMs per month. Is that even possible? It is. I'm going to show you how to do it, okay? So first things first, you got to buy 100 age accounts if you want to send 100,000 DMs, okay? Now, as a disclaimer, I don't recommend you to do that right away. I recommend you to start with like one or five accounts. See if you can get a proof of concept and then scale the operations if it's working for you and if it makes sense, okay? So uh, you can buy accounts from sites like Bulk Accounts Buy or you can use Z2U or you can use whatever site you want. I don't really care. This is just what I recommend, okay? Uh, they should be aged accounts, preferably no DMs history and uh, I would purchase with emails like G GMX gmail or similar email emails where you don't need to uh, set up like a recovery email or you can purchase them with like a 2fa uh, verification code that allows you to bypass this okay now next step is to buy 100 static proxies so it's one proxy per one account people ask me that all the time i do that just to keep the account safe make sure they are healthy and they are not getting suspended uh while they don't need to okay Again, static private means it's not shared with anyone. That's why I recommend a residential proxy, okay? You can find them basically anywhere. This is the site that I recommend. You can use it or not. Uh, I don't really care. Now, uh, next step is to download a anti-detect browser. Now, I'm just going to click over these steps to uh, get into the real stuff of this video. So, uh, you can watch other tutorials that I made on this uh, YouTube channel if you want detailed steps on how to set this up. Now, don't download entire tech browser. For those of you that don't know, this is to combine all of these steps, right? So you have 100 Instagram accounts and you need to log into them and connect to them and open them, right? If you would do it on your normal browser, first of all, that would suck. You would have to have 100 different browsers, tabs open all the time, accounts would be logging out, logging in, and you would get suspended within minutes, okay? So that's not possible. So in order to do that, you need to download something that's called anti editor browser which is an app that allows you to connect proxies to the account what proxy does is uh it allows you to act as a different device you connect to a different device and then therefore the, the browser thinks you are acting from different device right so th this way you can open up like 100 different uh, uh device instances on one computer with the proxies and with the anti editor browser right so you can use hide my account you can use ads power like all these are basically the same software just put up differently they have similar pricings nowadays i tend to use ads power but use whatever you want okay so uh you download this one you connect the accounts there you add the proxies uh, you log in the accounts and you set up the accounts however you want for outreach now what I want you to do next step, if you want to do the 100 accounts route, you need to set up something that's called virtual private server or VPS in other words, okay? What this does is it lets you rent, you essentially rent out computer, call com computer running in cloud from some company and you're able to access it anytime you want and it's running 24 seven. So that, that way you don't have to have your own computer opened all the time and you can just access someone else's computer and have run your own applications there, okay? So uh, what I've used before, Contabo, or this inter-server Windows, this is pretty cheap one. And uh, so choose again, whatever you want. Uh, the performance will, like the specifics of the computer will rely on how many accounts you have. So feel free to reach out to me on Instagram about that if you have questions. But uh, yeah, choose whatever VPS you want, that doesn't really matter, okay? You can use Windows, or you can use Linux. Linux is gonna be a cheaper one, but that's really hard to set up. Uh, with the ads bar, you will have to you will have to reach to me, reach out to me on Instagram about that. Now, once you have that, you can download something like uh, once you have the cloud, 
you can connect to it either by like remote desktop connection on windows you can uh, download apps on mac like just use chat gpt to connect to it it's not that hard and then from there you just open up the uh, anti-attic browser there you connect the accounts and uh, in the meantime you also need to start building your lead list right so in order to send 100,000 DMs per month you need to have 100,000 leads right that's obvious so uh, to get leads you can use tools like parser.im that I use a lot I essentially don't use anything else nowadays I've already made uh, my last video about it so feel free to check that out you can still use IG and I guess I've not used it for a long time and you can use uh, instant data scraper but this is only viable right now uh, for unverified accounts and like you can still get away with using it but uh, just make sure that the your account will get suspended so don't overuse it now the next step is to connect the accounts to a cold DM automation so again you can use whatever cold DM automation you want I do recommend using cold DMs that has been proven to be the most stable one for me I know there are a lot more out there so uh feel free to explore and try it out okay so i'm going to be showing you how to do this with call dms but use whatever you want so you will connect the accounts to that automation and so this is a browser automation that's why i need to have all the accounts opened and uh, the next step you're going to connect to them and start warming them up right so you don't want to start sending 40 50 dms right away the accounts are just going to get suspended right so the first thing you do with the accounts is you log them in you let them rest for a day, you change your names, usernames, the bios and the pictures, you can do that the next day, just set the account up like you want, I recommend like nine posts, have the account open, uh, add some following, right? start following some people like 100, 200 people, buy some followers like 500 to 1.5k, more than that doesn't really make sense for most people and uh, just make the account look real you can post uh, stories if you don't know how to do that i've already recorded a video about that as well where you can use like android emulator and connect with uh, like act as a phone essentially and therefore you will be able to upload uh, stories or like external links to your bio things like that i've already covered that i'm not going into detail about that right now now the next step is to integrate with instance right so what happens is that you connect all the accounts to the browser I'm gonna show you right here so this is how it looks like for example my environment so I have a Linux VPS because that's the cheapest one right I use ads power and uh, then I have the accounts open so what I do is I'm gonna show you <laughs> like this knowledge has taken me hundreds of hours to to finally figure out but I'm excited to share this with you so this is all the accounts right here, right? So this is, for example, one, one client and these are their accounts. So what I do with these accounts is I open the accounts up, I log into call DMs, I download their extension. And then what I do is uh, I just make sure it's turned on. So that's uh, it. I can check that here in call DM. So for example, let's open one of the campaigns. Right now, I don't think the accounts are gonna be opened. So basically how it works is we have a schedule, it's sending like uh, 12 to 16 hours a day where the VA just goes and make sure the accounts are running every single day. I don't really have to do anything about that. I just pay them some fee for that and they make sure it's running. Now the call DMs takes care of the rest. So you just download the extension, make sure it's running like this. And then what I want you to do with the browsers is go here into settings. This is really important. Go into settings this will make sure that the browsers actually don't go off and because what happens if you have, have tried this in many cases uh the automation will stop uh somewhere in like two three hours of in inactivity because you maybe have it minimized so what you need to do go into settings performance and always keep these sites active you need to add instagram.com here okay so this is what you need to do. And then you just uh, also check out this. And that's basically what this one didn't have it because we just connected the accounts yesterday. And so I just wanted to show you how it looks like. So uh, this is it for the uh, making sure that the browser is on and move on to call DM. So you can just set up campaigns like this. 
you can set up on multiple different occasions. For example, you can see here 120,000 DMs sent uh, over the month. And uh, here is we can manage the campaigns. You can see the replies, right? But what's the problem here? The problem here is that you need to reply to the messages, right? So you would have to go here through all the accounts that you have. And you would have to scroll through here, open up all the browsers and just make sure to reply through all the messages. That's just real difficult. I've been doing that for months and it's just uh, really painful. So what I found out is this tool called Instaset that allows you, they essentially have integration with Instagram. So it's like ManyChat where uh, they have their official API. So you have no chance of being suspended because of this and you're able to manage the inboxes. So what you can do here, like you can follow their tutorials. I'm mainly going to showcase you the platform. So like you would go into com uh, integrations, Instagram, connect your accounts, right? And then you just figure out the conversation. So you can either, you, there are a couple of ways you can use it. You can use it just for the Unibox, just for a combination like of the inboxes you have, or you can also use it for AI replies, which is something I've been uh, working with lately. It's not perfect, but it's uh, getting results and uh, we are slowly improving it, right? So you can train the bot here on your uh, data that you want and it's gonna actually reply itself which is kind of crazy so you can see here these are like the bot replies that we trained it for here we are just looking to collect phone numbers right so for example if i scroll somewhere here uh it's actually collecting the phone numbers what it then does it takes it takes number saves it into a sheet and then uh that is where we uh, use it that is where we do other automations with it like with zapier right so to set this up I'm not going to go into super detail. It would be best if you reach out to Instaset support and they help you set it up. They're extremely friendly. And uh, yeah, so definitely for someone that is using Instagram on more than 10 accounts, I think just the Unibox feature uh, is going to save you 10 plus hours a week. Like if you're planning to do follow ups, especially and just making sure all the conversations get handled. This is like what actually helped me to sustain this kind of volume because without it, it's just extremely hard to be able to navigate with, within all the accounts and it's just uh, a nightmare, okay? I heard Call DMs is also launching Unibox soon, so maybe you are gonna be able to get away with uh, just using Call DMs. And what is the last step? The last step is to delegate the campaign management to, to some virtual assistant, right? So this is what I did. I automated the replies with the AI and then the last step was the campaign management. So these campaigns here still need to be managed somewhat. Someone still needs to make sure they're running from time to time and you don't really want to have the hassle to, to care about that. So you hire someone from Upwork, from Fiverr, where you want, or you, I've even found VAs on Twitter and you can find them anywhere nowadays and just make sure to record the SOPs for them, make sure that they know exactly what they need to do on a daily basis. You check out, you check with them for accountability, but make sure, even when this is automated, you always need to be iterating, okay? You always need to be checking what are the results we are getting, are we getting to the KPIs, how can we improve, okay? Always make sure you are doing this to make sure your clients are happy, your results are good, and you can continue scaling up okay so like there is no upper limit to where this where you can scale this you can scale this 200 300 500 i even know people that were running thousand accounts so this might sound crazy to a lot of people but it's possible you just have to have the right infrastructure okay so if you have any specific questions feel free to comment them down below i'm gonna be replying to all of them alternatively you can reach out to me on telegram and if you really want to support me, you can check out our uh, Twitter outreach tool that uh, we are working on. But other than that, I thank you a lot for your attention for this video. And uh, I'm going to see you in the next one.